Well, the new Tears of the Kingdom trailer came out a couple of days ago, and the basement thought, why don't we put our opinion on the internet? Yeah, everybody else has their, you know, their reactions. You have your own individual reaction. We'd love to hear what you thought when watching this, but we figured since we're a Breath of the Wild heavy channel <laughs> and we've been waiting for this so much, uh, a lot of you guys probably want to see our take and our reaction on it too. I have seen it once. Peter, you've seen it once? You didn't watch through it a bunch? Uh, yep, no, I've seen okay, it once, cool, so we're so. going to kind of discover it together. Yeah, and so we're going to probably like pause it a little bit here and there, but we're going to watch through all the way one time, and then we'll kind of go back and like spot check and look at some details and stuff and uh, kind of throw our thoughts in there. And if you have theories and stuff, share yeah. them down in the comments. Yeah, or if we miss anything, point it out. Oh, please. Timestamp it. Yeah, all right, here we go. Oh, E10, E10 plus. Which, that... I actually hope, concerns me a little bit. I hope it's still edgy and dark. Yeah, even I hope though, it's like a Temple of Doom PG, not a... Not like, this is safe for three-year-olds. Yeah. It looks dark and edgy right now. It does. I like the light-up stuff on the ground there. Yeah, the swirls. And the then like swirls. the like the grand opening lights are kind of funny, too. Look okay, so this crazy... looks like a camp here. Oh, but look at that weird tree in the background. Yeah, that's like glowing. See, there's a three-headed dragon. Oh, oh it's my a gosh. Gliok. It's a Gliok, dude. Oh, there's <laughs> bosses. Oh, I was so... I like that shield a lot on Link right there. I was so distracted by Ganon's voice acting, which I'm not yeah, impressed with Yeah, I was not yet. thrilled with it. <laughs> I thought it would have been like... Rise, yeah, I was expecting I something... I am Ganon. You know, Instead like, it's like, Inspector I am Gadget. Ganon. <laughs> okay, their horns are longer. Yeah, they're looking more bad, bad guys. Look at the weird... Goopy spaghetti coming out from under the castle. Giga clan stuff. That's a Orbs fast anger. Hinox. He's yeah. got like a glowy something on him. I love these flying dudes. That it's like a stinking boss. It makes me think of like a golem. I yeah. You'll be able to stop him. Oh, this music. Yeah. So amazing. The, look at the ground. There's like weird uh, stuff on it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. There's that so many arrow things seems in to be sky. like a homing thing. I like that weapon. Yeah, shooting like a bomb. Look at he's got a robot arm. He's it was like a two-handed weapon animation, like when you do that, a ground what strike. What the heck is yeah, a car? I don't know. And a drone. <laughs> yeah, really. I love how they're like people figure out how to do this anyway, so we might as well put a machine in there that it does it. <laughs> <laughs> what was that thing dropping down from the sky? I don't sky? know, like a shooting star. I think it might have been a tear of the kingdom. You know, just kind of like running down the face of Hyrule. Look at his hands all withered. Please, lend him your power. Who? Dude, that's very. Who? Who's? Who is giving? Who that's she very talking goosebumps. to? Goosebumps. Yeah, I don't know. Midna. Maybe all the Zelda's past. Maybe like all of the pre-incarnations. <laughs> is that what they're called? <laughs> Precarnations. <laughs> okay. So now, okay. That so was, now we're that gonna was take our, our initial... time. Oh my gosh. Okay. So. All right. Okay. Pause it right here. So there's a green swirly down in the bottom corner. There. Yeah, it kind of looks like the thing from the very first trailer. Yeah, and they appear a few different times in different places. So I don't know what the deal is with those. These are like little markers on the on the map. Yeah, that could there's be Death like, Mountain over there. Okay, like there, something to do. Death Mountain's looking weird too. It's looking kind of malicey. Yeah, it's looking pretty malicey. Okay, I love these flying bat things. This just seems like a new like enemy, like. Moblin, Bokoblin, Lizalfo, these guys. The, these guys would be... I'm guessing they'll be common-ish. Stalfos. And I like all <laughs> of the wooden platforms, too. This looks like an enemy camp, but a new... Yeah, oh, stop, go back. New oh, style. Oh, you, you, you moved ahead. There's a floating island up in the in the sky. You can't see it now because it's dark. But, uh, whoa, I, oh, my oh. gosh. So yeah. there's, there are a couple. You see them in the, in the clouds? Yeah, we don't have uh, granular moving around here. Okay, hey, there. Oh, yeah. See that? Yep. That's a... I, I I would be remiss to think that they would put stuff that you can't do that looks interesting. Like, you know, they got like the, the mountains and stuff. They're always in the distance or whatever. You can't get to sure, in the original. Sure. But, uh, but I think that's, yeah, I don't think they would do that with the islands. And I think uh, it's probably low texture, but it doesn't need to pop in. Yeah. Does no. it? Oh, oh, there's more on the right side, too. Yeah, See you're those? right. See They're it? so, like hidden i'm excited that this game was developed for the switch from the ground up rather than for the wii u and then like kind of yeah partially converted yeah. okay yeah, they, what is this like grand opening okay those so towers those, they look like towers right will they unlock map will that be similar to breath of the wild i don't know 
Yeah, I wonder if they're gonna do that whole unlock the map thing again. It's gonna be so weird. How are they gonna? They're, they're basically gonna have to like reset. Is this like Dark World? Is this not actually the same Hyrule that we've been in before? What if this is Dark World? I bet it's the same. I bet it's just like a different time. And so some structures aren't there anymore and others yeah. are new and weren't there before. I wonder if it's like the future or the past or something. Oh, <gasps> the column of cloud. Look at that. It's beautiful. Well, it's like Old Testament y. Yeah. Oh, it's a spinning. Yeah. <laughs> it's a spinning. <laughs> it's a spinning. <laughs> yeah, there it is, sitting there, just party as a peach. <laughs> and then there's one of those little platforms down there that you go bloop, that you glorp through. Okay, dude, there's so much to see in yeah, every yeah. single shot. This it's, is crazy. It's, These this mushroom tree trees here is really cool. That is so neat. That twisty, goopy, amber bottomed tree. And this looks like it could be one of those like talus rises out of the ground things and has like part of the remember That's from previous totally trailers. what that looks like. Yeah, and look at those cool mushroom trees. In the, in the kind of the background there. Oh, yeah. Sorry, like this. Yeah. yeah and there's another one over here, yep. like shelf mushrooms. Oh, those and are And they're neat. like drippy with like... It's cool. Like, this actually feels like a different... Are these tears? ...game of the kingdom? Well, remember like the tears... They look like wisps. ...thing in Twilight Princess? Yeah, but those and are all too close And everyone was like, together. it's too long. And then Twilight Princess HD had a shorter version of it. Yeah. Push the play button. I wonder if they move. Oh, they're floating around. They're like spirits. They flicker. They're like <gasps> will-o'-the-wisps. You know what that reminds me of? Twilight Princess. Stop. Stop right there. In Twilight Princess, remember when people were ghosts? They would be like yeah. blue flames. Yeah, like the pose that you would go get or yeah. whatever. Yeah, and this is this is the High uh, Hylian Bridge. Right. This is the bridge with but the big. But that's totally a Gleox on that. Yeah, that looks like three-headed a, a, flaming a dragon. Gleox. I wonder if. Uh, when you deal enough damage, if the head will come off and float around <gasps> all flamey. I hope so. Like in the original. Oh, dude. The OG. I love the red tendrils coming off of the bottom of Hyrule Castle. Yeah. Yep. My servants. Sweep. See, there's another one of those swirlies. Yeah, so now this is a... So, I wonder if this is going to be like a fast travel location, whether or not it's something like a shrine. But if there's going to be, if that's oh, yeah. how we're going to get around. Oh, yeah, I don't see any shrines so Or if far. that's like a portal to an underground layer. <gasps> or up. Or that up, That might right shoot to, up. That's how you blorp. <laughs> it's the blorp machine. Dude, that's Hot Tenno uh, uh, Tech oh, Lab. Oh, yeah, you're right. And there's, like, there's, there's the Guardian on top of it. Yep. Yep. Okay. Oh, so we know where this is then. Yeah, so this is the this is the world that we've been in. Or at least it looks like it here. And it doesn't look like it's too decrepit. So it's not like this is in the future. And it's not in the past either, because... Well, I think it's supposed to directly follow. Well, yeah, but sequel could, you know... Avengers Endgame was also a sequel, but they spent a lot of time in the past. Yeah. Love, Blood Moon rises once again. Love that shield. That shield is really cool. Do we have broken barrels like that in Breath of the Wild? I mean, yeah. there's broken barrels, yeah, but they're, they're broken barrels. Do they look like that? Well, maybe. They're probably <laughs> slightly different. No survivors. No survivors. No survivors. What are those? Tears of the Kingdom? <laughs> yeah, well, little meteors, I guess. Oh. Will the Blood Moon play a more hey. significant role than just like respawn mechanic? Hey, Peter, why does a moon rock taste better than a space rock? Because it's a little meteor. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> hey, there's another one of those blorp tornadoes. Yeah, I saw it. Little green guy. Okay, that looked like a like talus. an igneo talus yeah. falling apart. I so think these, they probably just use that. So there's some sort of like the blood moon is raining down and that's causing all of the world to change. So does this look like Hyrule Castle oh, pre Ganon in... Breath of the Wild. No, this is definitely post calamity. This is the same one that we've, you know, been in and all over the place. Right. Yeah. So like, because you see, it's overgrown with, like, and, it's, and stuff. Yeah, it's yeah. already got some damage, but and, like it's this definitely is tattered and everything. Uh huh. Yeah. Look at their long horns. Oh, look at their like they're floating. They're like floating like zombified. See, that's pretty dark, Peter. What are you telling me for? Well, you were saying that E10 Plus is going to be like, oh, it's going to be like a Kirby game with Zelda in it. Yeah, it's <laughs> it's for babies. <laughs> yeah! Okay. Yeah, they're there. Are these guys? 
Yeah, they definitely like hovered down like, oh, <gasps> do we got some newish that's enemies a, that here? That thing, that's like a legit Stalfos. It's not a Stalbocoblin or a Stalmoblin oh, right I, next to him. What happens if I, how do uh, I? Yeah, I don't know how to spot. Uh, Look at, there it is. Okay, it's, it's the thing that you're looking at right now. Wait, yeah, no, that's, this wait, thing. hold on, that's Lizalfos that pops up, I think. I'm not sure. Oh, yeah. See? Yeah. That's a legit Stelphos, I think. It looks like, um, like a redead. Oh, please. It's something. That does look like a redead. Oh, my gosh. And this thing is like a really big piggy bokoblin, like a super bokoblin. Oh, yeah. It looks it's like not Hinox a Hinox. Size. It has two eyes. Yeah. Oh, there's a lot going on here. Moblin. Yeah, and then we have a Moblin here, right? So it's kind of a couple of standard enemies and a couple of newer enemies. That's a horse. Is that Zelda or Link? <laughs> That's Link. It's totally Link. He's got a shield. But is it Zelda? That's Epona. That's what that is. There's our smoke column again. Dude, that thing's got to matter. That's a fixture. Is that... That's so cool. Okay, this. I'm excited for this. This looks like it's somewhere yiga -y because... Hold on, that one in front is not a claw. The other ones are claws. That one in the front looks like it's like <laughs> a That's a, a cold air return. <laughs> 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 yeah, but these bars and these curtains and stuff, it does feel yiga -y. But this might be and like... And this is almost like high. a travel medallion or a... Yeah, like a... a like a landing like a spot travel. inside a shrine, right? Yeah, but so yeah, when you go forward, it shows a different angle in this room, and there's definitely Yiga stuff all over it, or or maybe not Yiga, but um, Sheikah. Yeah. Uh, wait, is that the Yiga eye or the Sheikah eye uh, up there? Yiga Sheikah. is upside down. So yeah. that's a Sheikah. So this is like a Sheikah thing. Yeah. It's a Sheikah thing. It's tears going down. It's a summer thing. It's a summer thing. Okay. Okay. Bokoblins with spiky horns. Yeah, there's the big there's one. There's the fat Bokoblin. Was he in uh, Age of Calamity? Uh, no, but what was the, what were the names or, um, of those, uh, in Twilight Princess, those, uh, big fat dudes that rode on the pigs? Oh, and they took a ton of damage and the one would knock you off that bridge, the Hyrule Bridge. Yeah, maybe they're, they're like and those. And you had to fight them so many times? Yeah. Could be. Oh, this I is like all the skulls. This is where Ganon's horse is. See the trees? Oh, yeah. Yep. I like all the skulls on, uh, the necklace of that big fat Moblin guy. Yeah, human skulls. Purple Goblin guy. Okay. This guy, he's got a stake in his head. He's faster. Yeah, or is that a horn? And what's the green thing he's got? I don't know got... what that green glorpy is on his neck. It's not an orb. Yeah. Like, Eventide. Eventide. Yeah, that was something else. I still else. don't know how to pronounce it. Well, I haven't seen a single shrine, which I'm excited about. Right. And I haven't seen any orbs or anything. It's like things are totally very different. Oh, look at those plants. Yeah, those, those are new. Those plants are pretty. The... Ugh. Dude, I'm <laughs> getting so excited. I think over the every Gliok detail. is the most exciting thing I've that, seen. So yeah, that far. Gliok is pretty awesome. Okay. Okay, so anything looking different here? Obviously, floating islands. We got a big right. block thing up in the top right. There's twin. Yeah, this feels new. No, that's Dueling Peaks. Is it? I thought that was. Oh, that is Dueling Peaks, over there. This is Where... the, oh, the mushroom. That's, hold on, that is area. that that mountain is um. The mountain we like to go to where Maglatan is on. Oh, Satori. Satori. That? That's yeah. Satori Mountain. Yeah. Yep. It's also got kind of some peaks on it, too. Okay. He's got that's the old paraglider, but it's so this new. all this all looks the same. So I'm curious to see what they do with some of the similar terrain stuff because this doesn't look much different. Yeah. Except for the floating island. Look at the, the big giant island thing up in the sky. Yeah. That's big. It's huge. There's going to be a lot to do up there. Okay. Is this Hyrule Field? It looks... Yeah, it's by the castle. Hillier. Okay. Okay, th so this is one of those dragon guys we saw earlier. He's carrying a Bokoblin. That'd be funny <laughs> if they can, like, drop him. Yeah, they're like paratroopers. Ooh, that that Bokoblin's got, like, an axe. I like the sun... hand axe. The low sunlight bouncing off the river on the right side there, too. Mm, beautiful. What is this? The... Yeah, that... I don't know what that is, but look at to the right. There's like a column. This? Uh, down a little bit. This? See that chunk there? Yeah. Those things are strewn around a lot. I wonder if they're like chunks of something, like meteorites or something that mm. blasted down. I don't know, but chunks of stuff. And what is that? I mean, this looks very big and flat. 
Yeah, that looks like one of those mazes. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, like a labyrinth. I like their helmets. Yeah, these guys got little helmets. I'm trying to figure out. Huh. Oh my gosh, this thing so looks this amazing. Thing. Okay, so what is this? What are these symbols on it? It's got a lot of like tech in it. Yep. And it looks so like this that is, arm people is People are going to say like, oh, like... this is clearly a Zonai robot. But it's got green energy, yeah, we don't not know blue that. energy. Yeah, we don't know that. There's there's a lot of green in the logo, too. Breath of the Wild was very blue. Yep. Um, which is like tech. Yeah, and yeah. I think green is like life. Yeah, well, green is also like links, like courage, like the courage color. This is the thing he's got on his belt now. No Sheikah Slate. Well, it's because his arm's got the powers now. Have you seen? Like, later yeah, on, that's he, how you he uses some runes, and rune. it's got arm runes. Dude, that looks awesome. <gasps> Wait a minute. Does he get flurry? Because he should have at that point. If it works the same way. There might not be flurry rush anymore. Or bullet time for shooting? Yeah. Oh, dude, Ganon's so... This is that's cool. This is creepy, dude. Look at those teeth and like and the... like the skin is all flayed back. Well, it's not flayed, but it's definitely dehydrated. <coughs> He's mummified. He's rehydrating. It's very don't important. put him in the rain. <laughs> don't feed him after midnight. <laughs> He'll grow like those uh, like uh, no, those like oh. dinosaur sponges that grow to like ten times their size when you put them in water. <laughs> yeah. Sure you'll be able to stop him. Okay, this is like a column of, of things. Of things, yeah, dude. That looks pretty big and pretty far away. Yeah, some that of them look sort of small. Looks very big. But then other of them look like almost that like looks steps. Very cubical. And here's Hyrule Castle way down here. It seems to be floating, which we've seen in the other. Yeah, that trailers. cube is the Borg spaceship from Star Trek. Here's one of the towers with like the grand opening lights. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> now showing <laughs> half this off <tower>. appetizers. <laughs> Looking good, Link. Okay, look at this thing. It's like vials. Ooh. Oh, he's got like charges of potion or something. I think that's where the tears go. From the kingdom? <laughs> maybe though. Well, I mean, maybe you don't get unlimited runes. Maybe you have charges of it. That could and, be. And like that can be Instead like Instead of a cooldown period, right? You've got like a, a bomb bag, right? With a ceiling yeah. sort of idea. Yeah. I hope so. Because that would be really cool to have to like. Oh, that big necklace that that, book, that giant uh, Hinox was wearing. Skulls, yeah. I wonder. No, no. The Hinox had the necklace with the green oh, orb yeah. on it. I wonder if that would be like give you another vial. Yeah. So then or you have like, another charge. Yeah. If there's small ones and then like big ones. Yeah, like things like that can the big refill your five current or vials, whatever. right? And maybe the big ones give you a new vial. It looks like they're putting some effort into outfits here too. Yeah, that's like beyond what he's, was. Look at before. he's got green under green under his chain mail. So the blue is like over the top. Hmm. Oh yeah, like you can see it here, and then there's the chain mail there. I love the fact that he's got like a robot hand though. That's so cool. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> it was like the coolest thing ever. Is that robot or is it like it's like mummy? It does sort of look like a claw, but it's also like a robot sort of mechanism kind of thing. So I don't know, but it looks like it's some kind of magical construct. Dude, he's on a quest. <laughs> to save a princess. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that it's shield, definitely got claws on they that. They put the same shield and the same outfit on him for the like the whole thing, I think. Yeah, and you're right. Like claws or like like gross fingernails. Are those bandages? I don't know. I want to know so much about that. I'm glad there's a lot we don't know, but I would I would love to get a barely done. I'd love to get my hands on that hand. I hope you could zoom out like that, but I don't think you'll be able to. Okay, so this okay, is cool. This is yeah, I saw that and it stayed on it for just a second when we were watching it through the first time. I want to look at this more. It's like those um Aztec drawings in the desert yeah and there's a good look at and one like of those how towers did those how day. did that get like unveiled this is my question oh and I there's that like... cubicle thing okay sorry ask, ask your question so how did this get un unveiled you know what i mean like we were already in this land how is there now a monument yeah what, what changed unless like a laser shot and like etched that into the ground later 
Yeah, or like a, some or creative you lawnmower. Something and <laughs> guy with a push mark. <laughs> <laughs> it's crop circles, so it's just some <laughs> bored students from Caltech. This is an interesting little structure with like some platform. How much you want to bet that way stuff? It looks like it's got a crystal on top. What if that's a big giant talus oh. thing? Oh boy, I don't know. Okay, here's one of these dragon guys. Yeah, up close. What kind of arrow is this? Homing. It's a homing beacon arrow. Wow! Ow, my, oh, my chest! My doctor, doctor says, says I'm not supposed, supposed to get, get homing, homing arrows, arrows in it. it. <laughs> <laughs> How did we do that? Oh, it's because only because we've been doing this a long time. This is such a cool thing. You're shield sliding. Yeah. Down like a skateboard, like following the, the rail. Like you're grinding. And this is on Death Mountain, is what this is. This is like a two handed weapon in the hand of a bokoblin here. Yeah, because look, down, like down below whatever. to the left, that's the steaming water that's down yep. there. So I think this is Death Mountain. Oh, say. you're right. It could be. Boy, look at all of that. I know. Oh, my gosh. There's going to be a lot to do. And, like, what? This looks like use a rune on it, you know, or a or one of your mechanics. It's use like your, a mountain has a zit, hand. and you got to pop it. Yeah, I'll bet that you can. <gasps> look like, at those carts. There's more carts. <gasps> oh, this is a thing you could, you could put carts on this rail, too. Yeah. Well, yeah, that makes sense to me. But I like that you can just shield. Do you think we'll have magnesis? I don't know. Yeah, magnesis uh, and stasis looks and stuff. So here's like a something. rune. What is this? You can rotate it on the blue axis or on the red axis. Yeah, <gasps> so it looks like motion controls or like, um, hey, it's a luminous talus. Oh, that's cool. What the heck is that? I don't know. And it's underground and there's stalactites. I love that it's underground. Columns. I'm hoping that's a dungeon. But um, it was in the next scene, I think, that we're looking at. This. Oh, yeah. So this looks very... I wonder if that's going to be motion controls, but also optional. Like, when you're holding a button yeah, like you to push or pull with it. magnesis, but you can like, use your But see how this thing is working? This is working it. like the um, those gyroscopic shrines. Mm -hmm. He's moving this thing, and that big island behind it rotates to match it. Oh, you're right, dude. That's a great catch. So this thing is the same shape is represented as by this. And look, it's like a bridge. He could use it to then get to the island on the left if he turned it that way. Yep. Puzzles. Or like turn it this way to get onto it. Yeah. Oh, cool. Is this is this the top of Death Mountain? I think it is, yeah, because Death Mountain's got weird stuff coming out of it now. Looks like uh, it's got the hair of a Ganon. minion. <laughs> Bad people. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you're totally right about that. And then you can, like, twist it. Okay, so Link's throwing what something What weapon is here. that? It looks like a, like a lacrosse basket, and you, like, have a bomb thing in it, and you throw it. It's like you chuck bombs out of it. Yeah, yeah. Like that's a, definitely a orb of blasting that came out of that thing. That's got to have finite ammo. I'm wondering, see, because if they if they give him charges of magic stuff, yeah, then they could give him magical items and, and still make them cool, but not have them be infinitely like way overpowered. Because then they can give you ammo. For right. Them. Well, and they had to way underpower the bombs as weapons because you could just wait for the cooldown. Right. And especially with, I remember with like the weapons breaking early on in Breath of the Wild, and me being like. Ugh. I'll kill it with bombs. And I was like, the bombs do two HP of damage. I haven't seen a weapon break yet. Well, <laughs> I don't think they'd show that. Showcase. Weapons also break. And people are like, no! They did get a lot of complaints <laughs> about that. I I liked it, but I, it yeah. took me a took me a it, bit. It took me a while to get used to it. Well, it's oh, fiery. That explosion so cool. He's it standing looks like in a, water. It looks like a bomb. It looks like it's a bomb launcher. Yeah, I've never seen an explosion like that in Breath of the Wild. Is he? Ho yeah, he's holding that thing. He's not. It's not like a detachment on his arm. Yeah, no, I think he's holding. He's that. like Mega Man now, but it's got runes on the end of it, like it's being powered by something. Who is this? You know what? Who is that? Who is this? Is this the goddess Hylia? Maybe she's got different insignias and stuff. Yeah, this feels very... Oh, I, I saw this before and I just was like, oh, Zelda, but... I don't think so. I don't think that Zelda... 
Do you think she's the tears of the kingdom? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, <gasps> she's reaching out to. She's touching Link's his goopy hand. hand. I that... wonder. If... That's that's Link's hand for sure. The weird. Yeah. He needs to clip yeah. his fingernails. <laughs> Those are kind of gross. But these aren't mummy bandages. We can see that. No, now. they're definitely like ancient gear. You know. Oh, weird. So she. Whoever she's got to be one of those like background characters. It might be that's Zelda. She, like Zelda, something bad's happening to Zelda in the beginning. He's trying to catch her. I yeah. wonder if we're, we're actually saving the princess again. Huh? Because I don't think there's ever been a Zelda game where you don't save the princess, except for uh, Wand of Gamelon. <laughs> well, no, you're still saving the princess because you're trying to redeem the terrible game that it is. <laughs> in Wind Waker, you're trying to save your sister. True. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you eventually have to save the princess. Okay, so uh, here's another rune. This, yeah, this looks like Magnesis. Is this the plateau? Uh, is this like the shallow? It is the plateau. Yeah, yeah, because there's the That's the goopy wall. mud. Yeah. But it's different. There's a chest. Oh, look at that cool chest up yeah, there. Yeah, stuff has changed in here. Oh, is that a chest? It is. It looks different, though. Oh, this is the thing where you uh, you yeah, took the I ball the with the chain in, yeah, and put it in there, and a Korok out came out. Yeah. <gasps> That's new. What is that? I don't know. It this... looks like a plug, like we're pulling a plug out of the ground. Uh, what if it <laughs> all drained here? I think we're scooping up chocolate. <laughs> oh, is that the tire to like that vehicle we're driving around later? Oh my gosh. It's like you're a part. Getting, you're finding parts of vehicles. I uh, Maybe. Because, okay, we're going to analyze that. <laughs> in a second when we see that vehicle because it does look like it's got a little axle thing. yeah yeah and it's got <gasps> so the tread okay yeah if the, the tread, tread is looks what we're like, looking for like that, army general shoulder but yeah that chest looks really cool things there. okay yes, yes that's totally it <laughs> that was a wheel so there's gonna be like crafting kind of well yeah or oh, at least you have to find dude, all the parts what a what a good catch peter is this yeah. full of energy juice tears? it's got headlights Magic? It's got headlights. It does have little headlights. That's cute. And then these things the are like snake wheels. Yeah, they look like um. But dude, that like almost totem looks, pole it almost, faces. It, it almost looks like crafted. Yeah. That doesn't. Well, look, yeah. I mean, these are just it's just boards. a box, and then a wheel's attached. What if there's crafting of machines in this game? Like you, the, I mean, that the could flying be. thing could be, and you just find parts, and then you can put them together at certain places, maybe. What is going? Oh so my gosh! If this that is different. if that is a thing, <laughs> we're gonna freak out. What is this? That's different. I don't remember that. That's familiar. And like all these, the way they kind of point up toward that. Yeah that that looks new though. That weird hole. But I am very curious about what's going on here. Yes, that looks like crafting. Like you find two headlights, you find some wheels, you find a thing, and you find an engine, and they're like, okay, you can make a vehicle. I mean, if I had to guess, they're all going to be the same, right? Like this but is like a thing that everyone finds, but you have to find the pieces. And maybe the same thing is true of like that drone. Yeah, the flying, flying machine. Thing. But look, see the wheel that you found earlier? It's inside that snake head. It's underneath the bumper. Oh, there are front wheels. The smaller there. wheels. Yeah. Because I was going to say the yep. back wheels are too big. Yeah, they're turning there too. What? How yeah. did I not see this before? There's a hot air balloon that, I don't know. that he's riding. Yeah. Yeah, that's Link, right? Mm hmm. It's got the same green energy. He's ascending. Oh, uh, the heights. Okay, okay so I'm guessing like... you build this too. What if this <gasps> is the same as the tire? And you just turn it sideways. It, it doesn't, doesn't have the tread. It looks totally different. Yeah, yeah. But it does have this. But is it's the got green see, it's got goo. Goopy. It's like glue. It's like uh, you got to find glue. You got to find some things, and then you got to find a controller connection. There's a sphere in the sky. I over know. There. I saw that. I that's... love spheres in the sky. That's... Oh, and look at all the goop coming off of all those islands. Is that yeah. water dribbling down or, or what? Smoke rising up. It's very thin and straight. Yeah, it looks like water, maybe. Or, like, maybe oil, like black malice oil. These all have, like, little <laughs> This is a long video, too. but I'm I having know. a really fun time. <laughs> well, I hope maybe it won't all make it in. But, like, look at how much there is, you know, that's foggy yeah. to do. I see why they didn't show us much, because we're learning a lot just by looking. Yeah. 
That okay, stop. Yeah. What is that? Uh, t- uh, technology. <gasps> oh, it's a piece of a maybe a piece of a machine. Fall, tears of the kingdom yeah. fall down, and yeah. you can use them to make machines. Could be. This is an unusual Dude, shape. That's a monster. That. That's is a this, monster. Way is to this happen. a tent? Yeah, it is, but I don't know of what. Uh, we've seen these, like those busted down covered wagons. Yeah. It's, what is this r- kind of roundy thing? It makes me think of that weird mountain that had the round thing that we didn't remember. Hmm. There's a lot going on here. Yeah, I want to get a look at that. That does look that, like a monster. It's, yeah, that's got to be a, important. It's a golem waiting to happen. There's big chunks of stuff falling from the sky. So where are those things coming from? Were they all were always in the sky? Or are they, did they go up? Well, the fact that the castle rose a little bit makes me wonder, like, if a bunch of stuff rose. But it's It, it could leave a lot stuff. of interesting stuff underneath as well if yeah. things came up out of the ground. And it looks like they ripped out of the ground. I mean, they've got, like, you know, pokies coming up out of them from underneath. Look at his arm. Look at his arm. Oh. Please, lend him your power. Who is she talking to? I don't know. Probably that, Hylia. It's got to be the though. goddess Hylia. Who, who else could she even be talking to? Yeah, and she's the one we saw earlier, and we're like, who's that? You wanted to see the hand, right? I just wanted to look at his arm a little bit, because it's like... It shows. It got, like, diseased and stuff. Yeah. Oh, dude, there you go. Yeah, his hand got really burnt. It's, like... Legit. Way up and it's to like, here, it's all too. withered. It's, like, withered away. Have you ever seen Princess Mononoke? No. Okay. Studio Ghibli film. Really cool. But the main character gets like this weird disease in his hand. It reminds me of that. Okay. Um, Are we seeing how the sword is like technology? It's a rune. It's a runic blade. Now. Oh. And the symbol of the Tears of the Kingdom is actually an or It's almost like an Ouroboros. Is that the thing where like the snake is eating eating itself? itself, But there's two of them. Yeah. Interesting. Two dragons. I mean, that's just, I don't know. That could just be like the cyclical nature of the It looks Legend like a tire. It looks like the tire again. that you find in the water. Huh. Yeah, it could be actually. These like dragon scales or whatever could be the tire tread. <laughs> Those Tractor of the kingdom. Dude, I almost gave a tractor of the kingdom. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no, my arm. Please lend him your power. She's talking to us. <laughs> I'm glad the date didn't change. Yeah, thank you, Nintendo. We're under 100 days now, and uh, there's some rumors that it's going to be $70 instead of $60. I'll pay. Yeah, Yeah, I'd pay. Not not a big deal. Eggs have quadrupled, quintupled in price. I'm glad video games didn't quintuple in price. Um, Of course, I'm I'm pretty sure chicken economy is different from video game economy. <laughs> Not in Cuckoo's Revenge, it isn't. Eggs <laughs> 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 are expensive. <laughs> but Zelda is not as expensive. Um, so, dude. So we're buying would... this right away. We're playing it right away. It'll yes, show up on absolutely. the channel. Not immediately. But, may yeah, we'll probably like wait a day or two. Yeah. But I think we're both taking like off work that week and just Yeah, no, I w- I want to like enjoy like the beginning. Ooh, Are boy. you guys looking forward to the game? Are you going to buy it? Obviously, if you're here at the end of this video, you care about the game and about our opinions on it. <laughs> <laughs> Let us know in the comments and uh hey, if you're feeling like you just can't wait any longer and you need something to fill the time we've got a whole bunch of modded zelda stuff for you to check out that's true and look at all the weird things that we've been able to do in breath of the wild while we wait while nintendo is making us crazy waiting for another few months or you can watch tunic over on our second channel which is a zelda like game and may help uh, hold us over until may oh, actually it will in, in the, the basement, basement.